Scarecrow Beats What's up my beautiful dudes and welcome back for another video with your girl Shalinda One if you guys are new to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and make sure to get the notifications so you'll never miss another video with your girl, Shalinda One. And for my beautiful dreamers that's already been rocking with me, welcome back for another video. Okay guys, so we are going to do this tag. This tag, um, the fall favorites tag of 2015. And I haven't done one in so long. I haven't done a tag video in forever. However, I am super stoked that I was tagged by quite a few of uh, uh, quite a few people, so <laughs> I feel special. <laughs> so this tag in particular was created and started by Jacqueline Hill here on YouTube. We all know her, we all love her. And so we're gonna go ahead and jump jump right in. Cause you know I can talk. If there's one thing Shalinda One can do, is talk. Very first question is what is your favorite candle? You guys, wait, is this on? Yes, it is. You guys already know that I am not like a crazy candle lady. I'm just not. However, there are there is a candle that I've had for quite a while now that I I'm loving since I brought it like the end of summer because I was like kind of pushing for fall to come, and it's called pumpkin spice. And this is it right here, don't get my, my foot, I'm like, but this is it, I took it out the jar and I put it in this because I thought it was so cute. But it's called Pumpkin Spice and I love for it, the, one, it burns like forever, really like that. And then two, I really like the fact that when it burns you can smell it throughout the house. So it just, I think it's the spices that really, it smells like fall, it smells like a little cooler outside, it just, it gives me like a little, you know, whatever, whatever, what, what the hell is that? What is, what is that, Shalinda? What is that? Whatever it is, I like it. Okay, the second question is, what is your favorite lip color? This is an impossible question to ask someone who loves lipstick. Out of all my makeup and out of everything makeup related, I think the one thing that I feel like I love the most is lips. So, I can't give you one, and I'm not going to do it. I'm gonna give you three. Okay, so for my favorite just nude color, when I'm wearing a very neutral face for the fall, it has hands down been Persistence from MAC. I think it's the closest one to my skin complexion. When I put it on my lips, I feel like I can just, I wear it by itself as as well as with a lip liner, but it just, it, it screams cranberry neutral to me. You know, very pretty. I do have it on in the middle of my lips right now. I love it. I love it. The second one is not as neutral. However, I feel like it's the one that's most like... It's, it's more of fall. It's just, it's a perfect color. I can just throw on with some jeans sweatsuit you know if I was going into a meeting real quick I can throw that on and this is sin by Mac and I know I like this a lot because I see brown and I see also see like a nice beautiful dark cranberry or burgundy so I like this color as well but my all-time favorite all-time favorite would be Vampira from Kat Von D I absolutely love this color for for fall winter spring but fall, predominantly because of how dark it is. I love this color. Good God, look at it, it's beautiful. It's pretty right out of the tube, but when she dries, she dries down to like a deep, deep burgundy brown. And I absolutely love her. I love her by herself. And I love her with a lipstick on top of her, which this is. I have her on first, and right in the middle, I went in with my persistence. And this has been my favorite lip combo of the fall. Like, I could wear this lip every single day. So the next question is, what is my favorite drink? And I'm sure you probably guys should know this. I am not like a Starbucks girl. I've never been, never will be. I am a True Blue DB. I am a Dunkin' Donuts girl. 
Um, and when I go, I pick up the vanilla chai with a little bit of extra sugar. I love vanilla chais. I even try to um, go to shop right and see if I could find the chai bags and came home and tried to make it and it was disgusting. <laughs> However, when I am home, I do like good old, I have two or three cups of it a day. And this is just regular Lipton tea. However, with the Lipton tea, my husband brought this home about four weeks ago and I've been in love ever since. Never tried it before. Never tried it before. And this is the Silk Almond Coconut Blend. Oh! <laughs> Instead of using milk or cream, I pour some of this in. And it takes your tea game to the next level. You can taste the coconut. You can taste the almond. And it's coconut, almond. It's very soothing and I mean it's oh my god this is this it's like I'm hooked I'm hooked next question what is my favorite blush and right now I'm kind of it's almost like the same thing with a lipstick it depends on the day my favorite neutral when I'm wearing my persistence lipstick very neutral neutral fake I love the Iman um, sable this is still one of my all-time favorites. Absolutely love her. My next one would be a Odie Book Goodie, and that is um, Raisin by MAC. All Dark Girl loves this. It's just a appropriate color all the time. However, when I'm trying to do a little something extra and I really want my cheeks to kind of stand out, this should be no surprise if you've been with me for a long time, and this is Persia by NARS. This is an eyeshadow, but I particularly use it more as a blush. This color on dark skin, get your life. Live for it, love it, hands down. It's amazing, it's absolutely beautiful. Okay, so the next question is, what is my favorite clothing item? And for the fall, you know, of course I have gen denim jackets and I love flannel shirts. I have a lot of these. I have a lot of these. Like I go crazy in Old Navy. However, hands down, my favorite fall item has to be my four 100% pure cashmere scarves. I love these scarves. I just feel like this scarf is fall. Period. Fall, scarf, scarf, fall. These scarves right here, I have it in this color. I have it in like a soft pink, which is really cute. But this is the one that I have to say is my favorite just because it's such a neutral color. It goes with absolutely anything. I can have on jeans and sneakers, and I can throw this scarf on, and it would just discard the uh, entire outfit up just like that. I can have on sweatpants. I could be out of my son's football practice, put this on, and I look like a million bucks. I absolutely love it, hands down. Favorite fall clothing item. My favorite fall movie. I can't answer that. I don't, I can't think of any particular movie right now that I've been loving. I can't. Next question is favorite fall TV show. And I know you guys are probably going to be saying, okay, she's going to be on a bandwagon with Scandal. She's going to be on a bandwagon with Empire. And they're both pretty decent. I haven't really been feeling Scandal. Since it's been back on, I actually haven't caught not one episode. And Empire was real fly, still is a really good show, but it's not my favorite. My favorite show right now is a show called Survivor's Remorse. It's on one of these cable channels. I, I don't know if it's Cinemax, HBO, Showtime, whatever. But I know its executive producer is LeBron James, and it is such a bomb show. I absolutely love this show. It's about a, a basketball player who makes it to the pros and he has this survivor's remorse. He survived, but he has remorse for those who probably didn't make it out the hood and always wanted to help someone else, help other people out. But at the same time, his family is like, look, bruh, we're trying to make some money. We're trying to take our empire to another level. You're trying to do handouts, back and forth. Love the show. The show is crazy. Pam from Martin is on there and Omar X. Mike Epps, sorry, and Mike Epps is on there, so obviously just those two people, you know it's funny as <laughs> of that show. I mean, it comes on on Saturday nights and I can watch them over and over and over. I mean, the stuff that they, they had one kid who was dying and his 
Don wish was for the basketball players to hook him up with groupies to have sex before he dies. They did it, and he died the same night. Like, oh my god! Like, it is such a good show. Like, who thinks of these things? Love it. Oh, one more thing. The mother, being that she's the, the boy's mom, you know, she has all these older kids, she realized that, you know, her vagina has been through some abuse. And so now that her son has all this money, she wanted a facelift for her vagina. Dope show. I'm telling you, the show was, Pam was crazy. Love the show. Go check it out. Okay, favorite Thanksgiving food. Um, honestly, to be completely honest with you, and don't judge me. I'm talking to you. Don't judge me, but my all-time favorite Thanksgiving food is chitlins. I love chitlins. I'm sorry. I, I don't know to tell you. My aunt, I miss you so much. Rest in peace. She used to make the best chitlins ever. My mouth getting watery. <laughs> she used to make the best chitlins ever. However, I've never quite been able to find someone that kill it like her. So as of right now, my favorite Thanksgiving food has been just the stuffing. We're not really turkey people. We actually sometimes don't even buy the whole turkey. We'll just get turkey wings. Because we're not huge turkey people. But we will make two and sometimes three pans of stuffing. Gotta have stuffing. Stuffing ain't right. Thanksgiving ain't right. Life. Life's not right. And the very last question is my favorite Halloween costume. Guys, you know the last time I actually wore a costume? I couldn't tell you. When I was a little girl, I was Wonder Woman. I used to love that costume though. No, I was really cute. But other than that, since I've been grown, I don't really, I haven't worn a costume in so long. I always dress Kennedy up, but I'm hoping to find a costume party. I would love to go to a costume party. But if I do anything, and I do have some makeup tutorials, some Halloween makeup tutorials coming up. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you guys for the four people, I think four or five people tagged me. We here. We here. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, you already know what to do. Leave them below in the comment section, and I'll be sure to check it out. Also, please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And remember, when you subscribe, hit the button next to it so you can be notified on all my uploads. Um, anything else? Nope. I love you. And remember that being on this earth and being a beautiful dreamer is so much more important than makeup and all this good stuff. It's about being a blessing to yourself and to those around you. Love you guys so much, and I'll see you in the very next video. Bye. Bye, guys.